discourtesy is ridiculously offensive to me. I want some ketchup as well, you know. <laughs> and my suspicions are that the Red Sox hat-wearing twat <laughs> is not a twat. He simply feels completely powerless and exerts power when possible, as people do. The only theatre for his charade of influence on a world that he feels out of his control is his local chicken shop. <laughs> <laughs> you man, wait up, yeah? This man's a dickhead. The dickhead wearing the red shirt is not a, a dickhead, that is. I mean, he still exists, barely, for his family. But time enough. <laughs> Personally, I'm not hungry. I'm in the chicken shop because I like the man in the red shirt and I think, <laughs> hello and how are you are better than fuck you. Discourtesy is a ridiculous form of power exertion. Power is making the man in the red shirt smile. Not quite. I'll veer away from the poem. I'm undecided on this one. <laughs> I think that power stems from the adoption of an attitude of benevolence and then simply existing. Forced, pressure-driven attempts at the exertion of influence have a high failure rate. Hey, mate! I will be with you in one moment, sir. <laughs> and having veered on to politics, because this is politics, um, you know, this kind of disempowerment of our young people is the uh, essence of you know, the rioting that we've experienced recently and whatnot, I'd like to uh, tell something political. Ooh. Which I usually do, but I don't know quite what. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> um, oh, okay, uh, two things, two things, two possibilities. Uh, graffiti, something, something about graffiti or some, something that continues on the young people trend, something about uh, young people uh, stabbing each other and shooting each other. Um, Here we go. Yeah, 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 okay, let's do, let's do that. We, we do noise. So, 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 so we, we, have a, we have a volume made for, for and, and be aware at this point that, of course, you're only going to be voting for my opinion on a certain subject. <laughs> <laughs> but, so, so, so we have a vote for uh, uh, the possibility of beautiful things, and we have a vote for our children. Um, either, either which one. Um, so, so, so make some noise for oh. something to do with beautiful things. Woo! Make some noise for our children. Woo! It's about the same. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll, I'll, I'll tell... I'll, 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 I think children... Was children a little bit... We do children and then maybe, maybe if we got time we'd, we'd, we'd t t t test them. Maybe. Maybe. Uh, so, so, something brief. Uh, this is from the perspective of a, uh, a teenager in, in London. This, this is actually from a musical that I wrote all the, the lyrics for. Um, uh, this, this is from the perspective of a teenager engaged in aggressive activity. Is it down to the fact that we love to hate? And the heart of a youth can never be faked. Take a younger man with no money, just feeling, knife in his hand and someone's leaving. Are we animals, really? Or is the differentiation that we're just small greedy? Is the urban split too thick, the tarmac strip or rip we need to zip to let us reach a natural tip? Yo, do you feel me? Is it down to the press? The media ain't no mediator. Tell someone what they are enough, that's what they'll be. Other people think of me, therefore I am. Tell me I'm a thug enough times, I won't give a goddamn. You could be a scumbag, or you could be a celebrity. There are good things to be that aren't on TV. Is the fact that we don't love police, because they think of themselves as separate entities, is guilty till proven innocent the best way to benefit our development? Can we be excellent? If we learn to live, to love, to play, to fight on internet sites and on playstations, we need real connections. Is it down to the government making the guns that set an example by dropping the bombs? Or what about the little bit fickle live life or a slap and tickle dads that are dropping their sons? Is it down to the fact that we like a divide? Is the earth a pie? A little piece in the pocket might keep us alive. No cash or turf, so we reach for the skies. Have we time for one more? <laughs> yeah. 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 I do the one that I was going to say about.
typography, or maybe just a three line closure. <laughs> True story. I know a guy named John. He writes spat. He's not a twat. <laughs> Tall and ginger. Got a family. Got a habit. It's graffiti. Two months in Queen Liz's custody. Belmarsh. Category A. Just because he wrote his name in public spaces for the fame. Do you know what sort of nick that is? Judge, he took piss. What are you in for, son? I'm an artist. Right, I'm in for murder. <laughs> if the rapist, and mind your background, Pete, the sadist. <laughs> Spat comes out, then Brixton Prison for painting murals in train stations. Bit of trouble with the missus, kiddies missing bedtime kisses. Of course, the other public transport vandals are working from the legal end. Viable because they're commercial. Money makes them whiter than white, like personal advertising. That's the game. <laughs> On your buses, in your trains, and you complain about the little bit of stain at the bottom of the carriage door because you've been told it breaks the law. Why don't you complain about the hundreds of posters brainwashing you every day on the way to work? <laughs> in, in fact, why don't we just call up Johnny? Get him to paint up the stations nicely. Instead of billboards <laughs> for Mackie D's, we'll have art <laughs> from the top <laughs> <of> <laughs> They can do the Belmar stretch. <laughs> Just for the seasons. Doesn't apply today. I wrote it a few days ago. The evening sun refreshes the mood of autumn becoming winter. Like ginger beer after oxtail rice and peas refreshes the throat of the drinker, sinker. Long draught of me, says the sun to the leaves on the tree. Before you say goodbye and float a little on the breeze. Mm. Woo! Woo!